Yo, this is the Scar City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And our sponsors are Alpha Claims and Hire Birmingham, the leading and best accident management company. Get a replacement car anywhere in one hour. I really appreciate you joining me today. And this first story comes from Liverpool. The story broke late last night. It happened in Stockbridge Village at 6.30 on Thursday the 12th of November. Paramedics arrived on Bood Croft after neighbours reported loud bangs in the area. Paramedics discovered a 19-year-old male who was found bleeding and injured on the floor. He suffered a serious gunshot wound and despite ambulance workers' tireless attempts of CPR, he died a short time later. We did show footage of the emergency services on the scene and also armed police patrolling as well. I'm sorry to anyone that has been offended by that footage that we shared. I showed it mainly due to the distance away from the scene it was. And also to highlight the realities because this is a very important story. And it's not going to get the front page of every paper. And it's not going to get the attention that it needs. But if the family do contact me to remove that footage, I will take it down. Police have launched a murder investigation into the shooting and blocked off a scene where the team was killed. Forensic officers are combing the area for evidence as police interview witnesses and ask people to come forward. In a statement by Merseyside Police, they said they launched the murder inquiry after a fatal shooting that was a targeted attack, they believe. Paramedics done CPR at the scene. They have upped patrols in the area as well to reassure residents. And Detective Inspector Tony O'Brien said the investigation is in the early stages and extensive inquiry is being carried out to establish the motive and to identify those responsible. This was a cold-blooded targeted attack on a residential street and has took away the life of a young man and tonight a family are mourning the tragic loss the people responsible for the attack knew exactly what they was doing and they need to be caught the police says and that was the story that broke initially yesterday and today a follow-up story has revealed his identity the liverpool echo has reported tributes are flooded in for a teenager shot dead as he's named as niall corrigan who was 19 years old he was from canny farm Merseyside Police launched the investigation after the murder in Stockbridge Village. Niall was found bleeding and injured on the floor and emergency services tried to save his life. His next of kin have been informed and the scene was cordoned off and still remains cordoned off today. Hundreds of people flooded to social media and expressed their shock at the news of the murder. But they were still looking for more information in the early hours of today. Tupac Shakur and K Coke as well. And the picture that was released of him shows him on a scrambler that he may have been involved in bike life. He was a fan of bikes and enjoyed this sort of thing. And the article that he shared on his Facebook page was about scrambler bike gang that posed for a picture in defiant police crackdown on bikers in Liverpool. This article goes back to 2016 and it's about Sefton Park and the problems that they had. And the video footage that was released shows bikers going through the streets and the police urging people to report them. So that was just a little bit of information that we've been able to find out about Niall as a person and also understanding why this potentially may have happened. I send my condolences to the family of Niall and please pay respects in the comments. I'll be back again very shortly with some more news. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And I really appreciate you joining me. Peace.